Thank you for watching Ad Cat Tech video. Thanks for watching my um toy and train videos. Hi everybody, here we are on Jeff's Toys and Trains. We got the Waffle Block Steam Train Deluxe. We got this as a gift for the holidays. And uh, we're gonna make a little video of what to get and what we think of it. So look at the box. And here's the set. You get a nice instruction booklet. Pretty much straightforward of what you have, what you need to do. Cool stuff on there in the layouts. The instructions are pretty good. And then what's really nice is they also give you a bag. So any extra pieces you have, this is what some of them look like, you can actually put in the bag and they all fit in the bag, which is nice. It zips up and it's a nice little set. And these are some of the waffle blocks pieces. Jeff, you want to show how to put them together? Uh, Just put them together. Show us. Oh, I like this is how you use some of the pieces. You just, if you notice some of the pieces of the track have little notches there and you can actually attach pieces of the block to the track and they stand up or however you want to do it. Just adding them in there like that, Jeff? Yeah. Cool. I'll help you, buddy. I know sometimes it's a little harder than it looks to put them in. I put this one in. My son's four and some of the pieces are easier or not to get in. The set on the box says it's from two to 102. Um, so we'll leave that as it is. And again, this is what the set looks like. Pretty much built. We built most of the set, a couple issues we had. You will need batteries for the set. And the batteries make the engine noise. And also you, there's a little dropper that comes with it that you can put steam in. So Jeff, can you show the, uh, the train engine and how it makes noise, buddy? And put it around the track so everybody can see. You notice, slow down for a sec. You notice when we see there's slight steam coming out. So you take water, there's a droplet. There's a space on the front that you do. That you put the water in. And from there, it actually uh, steams when you hit the button. Jeff, one more time, buddy. You see, it comes with some animals. There's a conductor for the train. You get the train and the caboose. Move it around the track, buddy. Show everybody how it works. Cool. Do you like playing with this, Jeff? Yeah. What's your favorite part of this set? Um, the trees and the cactuses. Yep, trees and cacti. Very cool. And you get a bunch of people. We have a couple extra blocks. And you get a bunch of people with the set. One is a mystery person, so depending upon which set you get, You'll actually get a mystery person, and they sell these figures separately hmm. for the little waffle block, block series. You can see there's about 12 feet of track. The box says over 12 feet of track. And the track, you can set up in a bunch of different layouts based on your creativity. And we like that. You also get to build a little house, which to be honest, I built my son four years old. I had a little trouble building the house and the train itself. So we actually built that with him and gave him direction mm -hmm. and I helped him build the train as well because the train was a little difficult for him to build and that's really it they connect easier or not some of the pieces are harder to connect we play with it we've been having fun what we really actually like to do is actually use and make risers for Thomas the train for the different wood and track master Thomas tracks. And that's not actually, to be honest, what we've been using this set most for. And let me show you how we do that. So by connecting the three waffle blocks pieces, we actually make little risers, and you can do this for wood or not. We also make tunnels and, uh, and rising tunnels, which I'll show you in a later part of the video with this. And then you take your track master track, and this is Thomas stuff, and we just lay it on. Again, I only have one riser here, but we'll lay it where the whole track is then elevated. And to be honest, this is what we've been using most of this for. So we've been taking a bunch of these, we'll make them. Again, this is how it connects. So you gotta do the edges. You're gonna look three pieces to two pieces. I'm gonna snap that in. Three pieces to two pieces. And then you get another riser building. And that's how they snap together.
So what you're looking at now is what we did with the Thomas Trackmaster. Like I mentioned earlier, we used the waffle blocks as risers. We made some risers, some bridges, some tunnels, and a whole bunch of other stuff. And this has been our most favorite part of actually using the waffle blocks, ironically enough, with the Thomas Trackmaster and wooden track sets. And this is what my son loves the most. We haven't been playing with the track as much, and this is really what it comes. You can see how cool it is if you had a lot of track. Hey, Jeff, here's another one. You want to do something else with it? You yeah. also get some of these smaller pieces for that allow attachments. So there's the front of the train that actually goes on the train that my son didn't like, but that helps you attach that. Or if you want the people, whoa, that's okay. Yeah. And you can see the water piece on the top. So the water goes in there. There's a little switch you have to unscrew to get the batteries. And you can see the steam still coming out. There's a little dropper that comes with the set. I wanted to show you what the dropper looks like. This is what you would fill with water, then drop the water in there, and that's what gives you the steam coming out. If you notice very slightly, when you press the button, there's a little bit of steam comes out. So where's the uh, top for the train? There it is. Let's show everybody what it looks like on the train. Snap that in. Choo -choo. And once again, looking at the box, we can take a look at the back. And this is exactly the set, 12 feet of track, over 177 pieces. This set did come with one surprise pack, which has a mystery um, waffle block figure in it. And each set does come with, each train set does come with one mystery box uh, figure. Um, you do need, keep in mind as well, that you will need three AA batteries. Um, which it does say on the box, they are not included. So you'll need them to make the sounds and get the steam from the water coming out of the engine. Also keep in mind, again, our most favorite thing of doing with this set is actually using the waffle blocks as risers for Trackmaster, Thomas Trackmaster, and Thomas wooden sets. Here you see the train coming around the corner. There's a little bit of a cave there. There's the house that we built. Um, you got a lot of trees, cacti, um, a bunch of people, cow, uh, sheep. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, please post them below. Be sure to subscribe. We're doing a lot of train and toy videos, a lot of fun videos, and a lot of reviews. So be sure to subscribe, and see you on the next video.